I say you make the most delicious. Uh, I'm so nervous. Oh my you gosh. You make the What's most delicious like? coffees. So I'm going to taste your food right now and see. Mmm, gosh. Good. Yeah, I'm huh? Delicious. <laughs> done, sister. Woo, we're breaking mm. the mold in the kitchen. Liesl, you're breaking the mold as well, right? Mm -hmm. Well, South Africa is bursting with talent, Leanne and Kia, and I'm not talking about your talent in the kitchen. I'm talking about breaking the mold. It's an initiative that encourages and empowers women to excel, fl flourish, and achieve their maximum potential. And today we talked to Alra Olifant and Manuela Hachtfeld about the positive things that this heartwarming program has to offer our Rainbow Nation. Alra, Manuela, congratulations and good morning. Welcome to Expresso. Yeah, good morning and thanks for having us here. It's a very very amazing thing that you are, are doing with uh, uh, the, the, the Break the Mold. Tell us why you decided to bring it to South Africa and what it's all about. Yeah, we're extremely passionate about it. It's a concept that we developed through uh, a lead in our company, Condition and Grenier. And what Breaking the Mold really is, it's a multi-tiered um, initiative that really speaks to uh, South African women. It provides them the opportunity to really come and share with us their wonderful stories of how they break the mold. And in doing so, we recognize and will acknowledge them for the contribution that they've made, not only at home, at work, or where they play, but more importantly in the communities. So it's about creating a culture of mold breakers in, our, in South Africa. So the Williams sisters were chosen to be your mold breakers for 2012. Yeah, it's, a, it's our inaugural year, so it's very important for us that we had to um, make the right choices and uh, being Octagon and known for its sports background, I think there's a lot of synergy in the Williams sisters and they have themselves achieved so much in tennis. Uh, they've come from a background where there was hardships and challenges and they've overcome that. Mm. So we really, really uh, appreciate of their support and uh, agreeing to come to South Africa and support uh, Breaking the Mold for 2012. Now, Manuela has also chosen for the Breaking the Mold program. Why did you include her? We're going to talk about you as if you're not here. Yeah, <laughs> uh, it's, a it's a really, really fascinating story. But mm. I think, um, and, and it's little things like this that makes us a sports marketing company mm. excited. Um, Manuela was uh, one of the first people, I believe, that inquired about the seating plan uh, of <laughs> when the tickets went on sale. Yeah. And she wanted to make sure that she gets the best seat in the house. And we offered that. You know, and uh, but I'm really impressed with her commitment, her dedication. You know, 14 years old, training four hours a week. Um, that a day, a day. That's very hard. 14 training. hours a day. Uh, four hours a day. Four hours at a day, 14 yeah. years old. So yeah, I think so. that she has the ingredients in the makeup to really, really become a good tennis player if she continues in this mold. And if you go back to the Williams sisters and how they have their ranks, I think you've got all the ingredients. You're on the right track. And for us. She's already a mold breaker. Well, like Mut say, and she is a mold breaker. The Oswabai tennis star of that unwifflek lang is Sharapova's sister, Steffi Graf is of Sharap Maria Sharapova's lang. Venus Williams, his sister, sister, work no halang. Steffi Graf also incredibly tall. One eight six is is your height at the moment, and you're 14 years old. How do you think of who who found you that as a tennis spieler? Is it makkelijk or is it moeilijker for you omdat jy langer is? Definitief een voordeel, maar het is baie moeilik om soos laag te bly, maar jy kom dalk vinniger by die bal en jy het meer reach om die bal te kry. En as die groot sterre wat ook net so lang soos jy is, geet dit vir jou hoop? Ja, ek geet definitief motivation. Nou, jy is al 20 op Suid-Afrikaanse ranglijs, jy het al oor see gespeel. Hoe het jy by die tennis uitgekom het? Hoe het jy jou ma en pa oortuig om jou te laat tennis speel, terwyl jy nog school te moet gaan? Nee, my ma het net gaan. Ek het al doen, sal sy my 100% ondersteun. Ek was baie jong, toe sê ek al een dag waar ek op Hummel doen speel. Dit is een groot droom. En dit is die ene ding wat ek sê, is never give up on your dreams, don't stop believing. En wie is jou groot tennis held? Besides Serena en Venus, is dit definitief Rafael Nadal. Ek admire die manier waar hy speel, hy speel baie goed vir my en hy verloor nooit sy cool op die baan nie. En wat denk jy van die Serena Williams, Serena en Venus Williams, wat Suid-Afrika te kom? Hulle is definitief een groot motivation om vir hulle een rechte leven te sien speel en het is een baie groot encouragement om dit aan te hou. Alroy, ek weet jy, I know you've got a message that I'm not allowed to speak about, but you would like to tell our viewers. Yeah, we're going to share it together. I think the important thing once again is that we believe in youth and passion 
and people who want to succeed and, uh, and persevere. And I was told that at five years old, you told your grandmother that, you know, you're going to play in the building. So you got your dreams set on, on very, very high achievement. So we thought, you know, she's got the best seat in the house uh, at the Standard Bank Arena next Sunday. So we will make it even a bit better for you. So we will invite you to Soweto at the Development Clinic with Serena and Venus. And uh, we'll give them a chance to meet them. And you can volley and see if you can have a few shots for them. It's a little word. Look at it. It's amazing. You go to the Williams Sissy Spiel in Soweto. It's very exciting. Oh, right. I okay. think she's at a loss for words. That's Thank great. you so much for this wonderful opportunity for not only uh, Manuela, but for all the South African girls for bringing out uh, the, the Williams sisters to South Africa, for breaking the mold and, and pushing women in sport. We really appreciate it. It's a pleasure. We hope everybody come and support us. Now, you will be able to come back with us and for us to tell you how it was to you in the Williams sisters. It's not even different. And it's not even one step further than Wimbledon. And further than your dream. Ja, Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now, if you, like uh, Manuela, have a dream, whatever your dream is, it could be to be a, a flight attendant, it could be to be a pilot, it could be to work in the aviation industry. Well, Leanne has some more details on that. That's right, Liesl. Congratulations, Manuela. We are talking about breaking the mold this morning. And like Liesl said, if you can dream it up, not even the sky is the limit, especially if you are thinking of a career in the aviation industry. Now, on the 25th and the 26th of October, Lanseria International Airport is hosting a aviation career day. It's for girls, boys, women, men of all ages from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. You can find out everything you've ever wanted to know about this exciting and an always evolving career path. You can go to Expresso's Facebook page for more information, dates, times, places. But if you have dreamt of the aviation industry, you want to become a pilot or flight attendant or an engineer, then